My name is Melissa and I'm a wild animal keeper for the Department of Herpetology. I was surprised by how smart and quickly crocodiles learn um, when I started training them a few years ago. I'm uh, the primary trainer. I go in with a stick we use as a target, a long bamboo pole, and a whistle. And what I ask the animals to do is uh, um, a behavior called targeting, placing their snout on the target without aggression. And when they do a correct behavior, I blow the whistle. Uh, the second person that's in there with me uh, gives the food item to the crocodile and that's kind of their reinforcement. Uh, we have one male, Cody, and one female, Pamela. Pamela is a bit of an overachiever and uh, Cody is a little slower in learning but still persistent and trying his best. Uh, we've run into problems with Pamela going over to Cody and completing the behavior we're asking of him. So we've also had to train her to station or stay in a particular spot in her exhibit so we could work with Cody. Sometimes visitors are astounded to see they're real because they're not moving around as much as I guess people would anticipate. But I would just admire uh, their size. Um, Pamela's about 10 feet in length and the male Cody is about 13 feet in length. They're, they're pretty much astounded that they can get so close to a uh, massive predator on you know, the other side of the glass.